I know I'm making too many videos, really big deal. I'm sorry about that. But I just have to say things because there are things need to be addressed. Like for instance, that guy Rochi 420, who is a proud British and who is a fan of Tupac. That guy claims that he's been Tupac's fan since 1995. Damn, 1995, this is the year when I may have went to elementary school, by the way. In December of 95, I turned 9 years old. That man is actually pretty old too. I can tell. It's probably 40 now. Damn, I will be 30 soon, next year in December. But anyways, um... Yeah, I, I really wanna address this shit because that guy says that if Tupac would be a rapper, wouldn't be a rapper, he would be a regular guy and he would be beating the shit out of punk kids like me. Let me tell you something. If you know about Tupac so much, why didn't you know that Tupac was shy as a kid and that he was not really aggressive? You know, Tupac was not really, and I read it in the fucking book, okay? I read the book about Tupac. And it says that Tupac was pretty calm kid who liked to watch movies, to like to discuss things. He was actually more of an intellectual. He was not a street fighter. He was not a thug. And he took that image, and that image ruined his reputation, really. Okay? So Tupac was not that. I repeat that, and I stand by it. Because I read a book about it. I don't remember what they call it, but I read a book about Tupac. I took it from the local li library, like nearby. Um, they have books about celebrities, so I read it. And I watch videos about him too. Like the video where he was talking about, you know why all these guys who are assholes, they are getting called a woman, and I'm such a nice guy, so I'm not getting none. And he said that he has this much respect for women and he's not getting that. And in the book I read that all the women Tupac had sex with the, the, the wives of drug dealers and all of this shady woman. So Tupac had problem with women too. And if not for rap, he would be a loser. And I'm saying it because like seriously. He would be a guy like me. He would be like a small man with a big ego. Now. Granted, Tupac was probably a little bigger than me. I saw his pictures, it was said that he was 5'11". I read on the internet he was 5'9". And he does look like he was like 5'9", 5'11". He was probably 5'9", when he was alive. I'm 5'6 and a half, 5'7". So Tupac was probably good 2-3 inches taller than me. He was smaller than me though, because I saw that he weighed like 168 pounds. I weighed myself yesterday, I was like... Almost 170, okay? I'm like 5'7", 170 pounds, okay? I'm pretty big man for my height. Even people say that I'm a small man with a big statue. So, but it's okay, you know, yeah, I'm a little bit sh shorter than Tupac. Probably a little bit bigger because I, I'm a little bigger than he is, but when it comes to size, um, that's just kind of like, you know, talking about me and Tupac size-wise, but character-wise, I think we were kind of close, because like I said, and I stand by it, because he was the guy who couldn't get none because of his temper and everything, and he said, if not for rapping, all the good things I've done is scrapping until the end of time, so he was saying that his mom used to tell him he was good for nothing, so like I said, the major difference between me and Tupac is the fact that he was good to the rap and I, I mean, can I speed the line? Yes, I can rap. But, I'm not a professional rapper. In fact, Rochi420, I, I did rap. Like, I have a tradition, if you don't know much about me, I think you just find out about me recently, but I actually been rapping Tupac year after year. Since, like, 2010 or 2011, something like that. Every day for his birthday on June 16th, I've been rapping his raps. I was basically putting the instrumental on my computer and I was rapping. And sometimes I've been even practicing. 
Now I know I have a strong Russian accent, so therefore I can sound like Tupac. Like there's another guy, Makaveli Outlaw. He was basically, you know, he rapped like Tupac and he got his intonation and he has right, right accent. And he actually did a good imitation of Tupac. Even though he's a redneck, I'm gonna give him credit because I'm gonna give people credit where it's due. And that guy, Makaveli Outlaw, he actually did good imitation of Tupac's voice. He got his intonation, the way he says things, he did pretty well there. I cannot do it. I can only be myself. And yes, I can rap. A little bit. Now, I know if I'm gonna spit a line, you're probably gonna diss me just because you hate her. And yes, you have to give me you know, you have to understand that I have strong Russian accent, which I cannot get rid of, because I came to the United States when I was 19 years old, and you know, there is something which is going to stick with me, but I don't know. I'm not going to put any music, but I guess just for you, Rochi420, I'm going to rap a little bit of Tupac's rap until the end of time, because I know it the best. I may steal it some words because when I rap, I tend to kind of go too fast and it's kind of difficult for me, but I can spit some shit, really. Let me do it right now, so. I guess I get addicted to a dark side. Somewhere in my childhood, I let my heart die. And even though we both came from the same place, the money and the fame made that all change places. How could it be through the misery which came to pass? The hard time made a true friend afraid to ask for currency, but you can need leave me when you need me. I never leave, honestly, you can believe it. As you can see, what a hard thing through it true. What can I do? Real homie make you get through. And if you knew it, new things, it you could. Cause in the hood, true homies make you feel good. And at the time, we've been acting out, call the cops. Making seize the peace, what is on my blood? And never stop when my mother asked, will I change? I told her, yeah, but I clear always be the same until the end of time. So see, I know I misspoke some words, I ate some words, but I would say 90-80% of the rap I kind of did clear. You know, re remember, I'm Russian. It's hard for me to say everything properly in a timely fashion because of the language barrier because you know the structure of the language, because of my accent, but that's the best I can rap. But again, you cannot judge me, because it's the same thing, like, you know. But I also can rap in Russian, so, in fact, that when I was in my high teens, early 20s, I used to write my own raps. They were more like philosophical raps, they were not about bitches, holes, pussy, all of that. Because, see, like, in Russian culture, this is people are more philosophical, like, in America, the raps are all about like hair, sex, hoes, pussy, all of that shit. In Russia, when people are rapping or doing their rhymes, they're all about life, they're all philosophical, they're all about like what's important, what's not important, all about relationship with people. Yes, they're about love, but when it comes to love, it's all more romantic stuff. It's in America, you know, people, men treat women like bitches and whatever. A lot of times, but where I'm coming from in Russia, it's not like that. In fact, that a lot of Russian men, they, I was even more cynical. And one of my friends, he's actually, you know, he can play the guitar and he's now 32 year old. He can play the guitar and he sounded person. He was his virginity kind of late too. And he was a little weird, but he was to date and he had a lot of respect for women. And he used to tell me, you know. What are the important things about women? You think pussy? No. Important thing about women is, you know, talk to women, have some interactions, deal with them, you know, have something in common. Because if you have emotional thing, that sex would be better. Because, trust me, I had experience dealing with holes, and it was not even that great sex, you know. It was just almost like jerking off, just about the same thing. So, that's why I'm saying, you know, respecting women is, uh, is important. And, Tupac had respect for women, he was not a thug. So, Rachi420, Ra get this bullshit about Tupac out of your head. Yes, he was a great rapper, that's why he was famous, he was making millions, and he left the legacy. But, if he wouldn't have that talent, he probably would be, not exactly like me, but he would have close personality like me.
believe it or not, and I stand by it later.